Hey YouTube, what's going on? My name's Fahad, and today I am here bringing you guys a gameplay commentary. This is very similar to the game you guys saw for my fifth prestige video. Same map, same class, you know, we, we're basically doing the same exact thing, except during this game, guys, I needed teammate help, guys. And as you see by the title, this video is called, you know, something like Teamwork Makes the Dream Work. And, uh, you know, I couldn't, it couldn't have been any more clear than that. It couldn't have been any more, you know, it's 100% true. Like, Teamwork literally made the dream work during this game. There was a little bit of a lag, like, tiny bit of a lag. I don't know. I don't think I was host during this game. But I definitely did have a little bit of like a lag issue here. You know, I'm, I'm over here, you know, picking up two pieces. You know, the triple headshot in the team in the team kill feed. You know, guys, and I just go, uh, you know, because teammates cap an A right here. I decided I was like, you know what, I'm gonna go help him out, give him a little car action, a little car help. I don't know what really happened there, guys. But this whole team, like from the beginning of the game, I realized that uh, the teammates they had. Uh, ooh, he got the poop ski. I uh, I realized from the beginning. Yeah, I was one shot there. I, I keep. I, I should not watch the gameplay. I should just talk, guys. Uh, but I realized. From the beginning of the game, guys, which is why you see, like, I, I typed, I said, guys, let's stay by B, don't forget, blah, 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 you know, guys, um, I, I just made sure to say that because uh, I, I knew darn well, I knew darn well, guys, I was like, yo, teammates are not going to be, able, like, they really don't even know what's really good for the most part, they're not going to know what's going on, I got to make sure that I, I am the leader of this team, and I, I had to be the leader of this team, guys, and there's, like, a little bit of a lag moment here, look at that, like, he definitely should have been dead. But either way, guys, you know, that's not too much I can, uh, I, I just gotta focus on this W here. I, I was really trying to focus on was this W here. This guy glitches out him. This is a really, really awkward little exchange that we had here. A really little awkward exchange. I don't know how many shots this guy had to get on me. But either way, I, I killed him. I don't know. It was just such a weird little exchange. I, I never thought I would have an exchange like that. Just went straight vertical on that guy and murked him. You know, he must have been pretty upset, guys. But I hop in here. And look, look at this Vision Pulse play, guys. I couldn't believe this. I had to watch this. I turned around. I'm pre-firing this guy. He jumps into the pre-fire. I mean, I guess I was kind of weak, but I made sure I watched that because I was like, whoa, 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 there's no way. I know I was not that weak. And this guy just jumps right into the pre-fire, and I have to keep reminding teammates stay by B because we lost B. These guys are like, they're going through, like, I don't even know what it's called. I, I, I'm forgetting what it's called. They're going, they're like, they're by B-bomb, basically, if you're playing Search and Destroy. So I'm just always telling teammates during this entire game, like, stay by B, man, stay by B. You know, we'll win the game if we stay by B. There's sometimes, sometimes I play with teammates, and again, I was one shot there. Sometimes I play with teammates, and I'm just, I even tell them, like, yo, please just go play Team Deathmatch or something. Like, you're literally not, you're not helping us win, and you're, you're literally just doing nothing. Like, you might as well just go play some Team Deathmatch. Mother of, of Rob Boss right there, that guy, or Bob Ross, whatever. Mother of Bob Ross, that guy was going off. Like, he wasn't going off, but, you know, once I really, like, started putting it in their mind that we had to get this win and that we had to, you know, do really well to, like, you know, st and stay by B, once I, uh, I realized that that was the case, guys, uh, you know, Rob helped me out a lot, and this guy was pre-firing it. He, he should, oh, my God, look how much, look at the lag, look at the lag. I can't believe it, guys. But either way, you know, I don't know why exactly I called my car in here. I don't know, and there's, there's just a good amount of lag. I'm not really feeling the lag. I don't know if I should upload this video because of how laggy it was, but I think it does get get better like towards the middle and end guys and right now uh they they do have like they have some flag caps on us and stuff and some and some cap points whoa that guy had an xr2 and he got totally schmam bing -long. i don't even know guys but i was pretty you know i heard him i was sound horn him there i got the little pre-fires on him you know I, I feel bad for him and you know it probably messed up you know his experience playing call of duty you know guys i think i do that for a lot of people whenever i do play against them i kind of mess up their call of duty experience a tiny bit but I, I you know i shouldn't you guys should persevere if you play against me you should you should love it and you should uh you know do the best you can but here we go. Oh, and I was totally one shot. And that weevil just melted me, uh, threw me right into the ground here. And I should be calling in my car here. I'm not sure if I do or not. Yeah, I do call in my car here, you know, to defend the B. I think I might even lose it before we get to because, you know, no one is literally, no one's helping but me. Like, and the, and the Rob Boss guy. I mean, there's people by B, but they're not really, like, defending it. They're, they're just getting shot off of it, like, almost right away. And, you know, it, it was just a pretty tough game. Like, I was sound horn him here, got, got a little pre-fire, murked him. And then we had to cap B back, guys. We definitely had to cap B back, and I gave him a little bit of a shot. So, you know, that's pretty good. And, like, the Hellstorm is not really good for B, for uh, B Flag playing this domination. It's really not. I shouldn't have really turned around like that. I should have uh, I should have backed up, man. I should have backed up. But that's totally fine, guys. Uh, and, I, and I just saw, like, I was like, oh, it's, it's looking a little slow, guys. If no one's really, because they're all going, they're just defending C, honestly. They're not even going to B. Me, I'm running straight to B. I know this guy was trying to blow up my car. I was like, nah, because I know that there's going to be at least someone trying to hop B. And, yeah, that's what I basically use my RCXDs for. I use them just to uh, hop B. And, you know, at this point, we're losing literally every flag. We just lost the flag. And, like, I knew. I was like, come on, teammates. You guys could do a little better than this. Like, it should not be that hard. Like, I don't get why. Yeah, you know, I slid out on him, like, right there. You know, that's what Haggy talks about. 
You got to be active when you're playing with that sub, guys. You got to be very active. You can't be, you know, uh, sitting back pre-aiming stuff when you're playing with a sub. You got to be active, and you got to be basically... You gotta, you gotta act, pretend like you're on PCP when you're uh, when you play with a sub. You gotta be very active, very fast, very you know, back and forth, everything. You know, I basically, you know, and right here, I think I'm typing a message to teammates. I'm like, guys, because I see that the round's about to be over, and you know, if this round goes by, yeah, you see right there, guys. It says team, please, please stay by B next round or we lose, because that is 100% true. We will lose if we don't uh, cap B here, because you know, it's just so clear, because we're getting triple capped at this point. They just capped the spawn flags, which isn't really that good. I'd rather them cap, you know, one spawn flag and B, obviously, because that would work out a lot better. And I did get to EMP that guy. Thank God he missed his shot on me. Uh, I was really, really week look at this cheeky wall run cheeky wall run mate really really good but i know that like you know if we don't play like correctly because you know capping a and c is not really gonna oh look at the bait and switch the bait and switch teammate didn't even know we bait and switched i was like yeah i got you teammate don't even worry i hit you i hit him with the bait and switch for you and uh you know they, they i think we lost by like one point this round yeah i think we definitely lose by like one point well, uh, yeah, so we go into the next round, and I, I just make sure I pound it in the teammates. head. I'm like, guys, you have to stay by B. If you don't stay by B, we're going to lose, guys. And after this round, I was 29-9, and nine, really carrying the squad, eight defense. Like, it was just really, really tough. Like, you know, the, the amount of, you know, coaching I put into the team. Like, you see that guy, uh, Mother of Rob Boss. I think he ends the game with, like, ten defense or something like that. He has five right now. He gets five more. I'm like, yo, team, please, hop B, please. And these guys, some of these guys on the other team are like, yo, please, please shut up. Like, you know, they're calling me names and stuff, blah, blah. But this guy, mother of Bob Ross, he, he said he'll help me out. So I really did respect that. You know, I gave him a little bit of pre-fire. That's the best thing about Vision Pulse, dude. You can pre-fire dude coming around the corner. And he's like, how did he know? But like, nah, man, it's the Vision Pulse. I made sure I got right out of there because, you know, I was very one-shot. I wanted to get my streaks. I think I do end up getting streaks this game. And I throw my EMPs. And I, I, I see that this guy's like literally right there. Oh, and the Guardian. The Guardian. Ooh. That guardian, man, it, it will mess you up. You know, I got my HCXD. I'm just gonna push it out. I don't know why I really did that. Uh, I probably should have waited till B was B was getting you know messed with. And I think that that guardian destroyed my HCXD, which you know that's that's pretty good. Like I guess that's good for a guardian. Like I, I don't know. I should I, I shouldn't want to really stay by B right here. Teammates are shooting the uh, the flag point, which is pretty good. You know, can't can't get mad at teammates. They're shooting at the guardian. You know, that's smart of them. You know, they're getting some hit markers on it. Not going to be upset at teammates for that. little pre-fire to their side of the map. Here we go. This guy thinks he's going to go unnoticed, you know, shooting in my spawn or shooting near my teammates. No way. You're not going to go unnoticed. You're going to get murdered by me. And I know this guy's here. I'm pre-firing him. I'm, I'm coming around this corner, and this guy caught the work, and this guy's about to catch the work. And, you know, I'm just getting three pieces out here. And I'm, I'm, I just decided to go off with a pistol a little bit here, and, and it did work. It worked in my favor, guys. I did get my HCXD once again. Only 200 points away from a Hellstorm, which is pretty, pretty good. I'm very proud of myself getting the Hellstorm. Oh, my God. This guy's literally right there. Oh, man. Uh, that, that's pretty good. You know, I love using the HCXD. XDs because it's perfect for defending B. Literally almost perfect for defending B. Especially on this map. It's perfect on this map. For I'm only 50 points away from a Hellstorm, guys. So I want to make sure I get that. Pick up the AR just in case I need a little, little long-range gunfight. Here we go. That guy gets murked. I got a Hellstorm now. No, I, I shouldn't even save it because they, B is indoor. That's the only thing I would really save it for is, like, for B. I mean, I guess if they're capping A, like, I can mostly, like, just go cap C. I know there's probably going to be some dude running through this door eventually, so I do hide in this corner real quick. Or I think, yeah, I was like, thank you, team. Look how easy it is because we're up by a good amount. Now we're losing B. It's pretty difficult. Oh, man, and I just got zapped right there. But I did get my Cerberus, so, you know, I'm not really mad at getting a Cerberus. And I want to make sure I cap C with teammates to get more streaks. Maybe I'll get more streaks. Maybe I don't. I don't know. But at this point, I'm 41 and 11 with 15 defense, guys. So I'm really putting the team on my back, doing the best I can. And, uh, you know, it was pretty tough. Like I said, it was, like, lagging a little bit this game. I don't think I was host, but it was lagging a pretty good amount. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, God. Oh, man. That would have been pretty good if I got the kill on him. But he slid in on me with the M8 and hip fired me. I don't know how that happened. You know, the hip fire M8, I guess, is superior. I was like, come on, guys, don't get lazy. They were getting a little lazy. I made sure I had to tell them. I was like, yo, do not get lazy, guys. And that's just the easiest way to do things. And, yeah, that was so easy, you know, the way to check it. And, like, I have half of my team at A and half of my team at B, which really, really makes me happy right now. Thank God teammates saved me right there. And I made sure after I told them don't get lazy, I think that's what really, like, put it into their head. Like, yo, we can win this game. Like, you know, I was feeling like I was playing COD Champs for uh, Call of Duty uh, Black Ops 3, guys. I felt like I was playing in COD Champs. I mean, obviously, Domination's not in the uh, competitive rotation, but... 
I felt like I was playing, uh, yeah, I just hop up and kill that guy with the little work ski. Ooh, and I almost turn on that guy. I get some good bullets on him. I was pretty happy about that. I know. I remember that. And I run straight to B, guys, because there's only two teammates by B. The rest of them are just sitting at C, which I don't understand. Some of the teammates, they did listen. Like I said, the mother of Rob Boss guy, he did listen. But other than that, it was basically just slow. Oh, no. Get, uh, I don't know if what I did with, during that visual pulse. I think I did okay. Ooh, the pre-fires. The pre-fires and the jumps, guys. It, it, it's just Call of Duty nowadays. That's what it is. Ooh, and look at the lag, guys. The lag was just a little funny. Like, I don't know. That's the only thing... I, I, you know, I'm iffy about uploading this gameplay is because of how laggy it honestly was. It was pretty laggy, you know, laggy like haggy. Here we go. Oh, man, but I, I think I do get a kill with the Semtex. No, I don't even. I guess they might have had a, uh, I don't know, but I think I get a nice little triple here. Nice little triple here, you know, you can't be mad at the triple hellstorm. And I just want to go defend B, guys. I see my, my Cerberus kind of trying to murk him, so I let my Cerberus go to work there. Don't even want to try to hold mid because I know my Cerberus got it, you know what I'm saying, guys? Pretty simple. And, uh, yeah, that's basically how this game's gonna end out, guys. You know, if it wasn't for me, like, it, like, th these guys would've lost. Th let's be honest. These guys would've lost. I'm sure that they would've lost otherwise if it wasn't for me, like, in their, in their ear the whole game. Like, come on, guys, let's get it. Let's get this W. Let's win. Let's, let's stay by B, guys. You know, 54 and 15. I think I went, I think I did a little bit better, but 18 defense, guys. Like, it, it was just real, real... It was real tough for them to get the win, guys. It was honestly pretty tough for them to get the win. The way that I was playing against them and, like, the way that, like, I, I was in teammates' ears, like, literally being the, the captain, bro. I was literally the captain of this team. Like, it, it was just a fun game. I just had a fun game. 56, 15, 20 defends, guys. Like, 20 defends. Get off of my flag. 21 defends. Like, no, you're not winning this game. I didn't want them to win. So happy that teammates actually got to help me out in the way that they did. Like, I, I couldn't thank them anymore. We're only two points away from winning. Thank God. This is just a really good game. I was so happy to win this. I was like, yo, I got to put this on YouTube, man. And I was like, thank you, team. Like, I, I remember thanking the team pretty, like, heavily afterwards. And that was just a pretty fun game. 58-15, six caps, 22 defends, guys. Like, sheesh, 22 defends. That's pretty insane. I think that dude Vark was host with his 28 ping. But, you know, either way, thank you guys so much for watching. My name's Fahab. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on social media. Teamwork makes the dream work, man. Thank you, and goodbye.